Hello my soccer universe. Well the background is not prepared for the Nations League draw because hey, this just fell upon us like that. Um, I really wondered about the scheduling. Can we do this just before the international break when everyone's already gearing to its national teams? Uh, yeah. I honestly I did not see it uh, by itself and uh, yeah, it kind of was felt dropped. I honestly even forgot about it yesterday in the evening. Let's quickly look at the groups. Uh, I want to actually start in uh, League D. Yeah, Le uh, Latvia, Faroe Islands, Malta, and Doris Group 1. And then Gibraltar, Liechtenstein, San Marino Group 2. I think the last one really looks good. I honestly, I detest what they did now that uh, A to C have groups of four and that we have one group of three for the smaller nations. I think the Nations League was so great for smaller nations to play against each other. But you know, I, I actually like the groups. I think that the um, group uh, one sounds a little bit. Uh, nah, they are, they are, they are even, they're kind of even. League C uh, we have Montenegro, Cyprus, Luxembourg, Azerbaijan in group one. We have Georgia, Northern Macedonia, Estla, uh, Estonia, and Armenia in group two. Greece, Slovenia, uh, Kosovo and Moldova in group three. That sounds kind of a tough one. And Albania, Belarus, La, um, Lithuania and Kazakhstan. Also a little bit more. I think the other ones seem not as strong to me, but I think group three especially. I mean, Greece is probably the biggest name in that one anyway. So that was always B. But Greece, Kosovo, Slovenia, that sounds tough. League B, my nation, Austria plays against Norway, Northern Ireland and Romania. Kind of an even group, I have to, have to say. In Norway, of course, we have Holland coming, so uh, he was in Austria, so that could be interesting. Uh, group two is um, Czechia, Scotland, Slovakia, that's interesting, and Israel. And Scotland, Israel already played in the previous version of the Nations League, although in League C. So I think that's an interesting one. I think group three is the one uh, that has the most drama Russia, Serbia. Turkey and Hungary. Actually, that's the group that I, I want Austria to be in. That the stadium, if we play in the big stadium in Vienna, is full, and that will be the big base chance that the coach finally gets fired if he doesn't do well in that one. But yeah, that's probably the most interesting one. Then Wales, Finland, Ireland, and Bulgaria also not too bad of a group. And then League A, the one very every. Uh, do we get any group of death? Short answer, no. Uh, group 1, Netherlands. I'm wearing my black Netherlands away jersey. Italy, Bosnia and Poland. I think Netherlands and Italy are, are the clear favorites. And that's actually an interesting matchup that I saw somehow coming. Group 2, England, Belgium, Denmark, Iceland. Again, I think everyone will expect Belgium and England to fight it out for the win. Then Group 3, we see Portugal and France meeting again. Sweden and Croatia round out that group. That might be the strongest one because Group 4, Switzerland, Spain, Ukraine, Germany. I think Germany got lucky. They're in the, you're in the fourth uh, pot and then you get Spain um, as the only other strong team. That, I think, Germany will look very comfortable being at least the second best team in that group. Probably even winning it. Let's see about that. Games will be played in the fall. That's very just for completeness sake. I made this video. I will get excited about the Nations League once it starts, but it's so far away that I'm not there yet. Anyway, let me know what you thought about the draw, uh, whether you like any of the matchups and any groups, whether you think there's something unfair. I think overall it's a rather even draw, maybe. Uh, the one group down uh, in League C I found a little bit more tough than the others, but hey. Uh, oh, things can change quickly. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like these. And I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, consider subscribing to my channel to keep you updated with all things that are rotating in my soccer universe. And with that, I want to wish you a wonderful day. Bye.